Oh, anyway, it's pretty fun too. Right, I know this video is meant to be the water purification kit video, but it's not changed at all. So I'll leave a I'll leave a link to that in the description because I don't want to repeat videos what's basically not changed. So yeah, so as you can see by the title, this is my signaling kit. I have improved it. I have made it a lot bigger. I have made it a lot bigger, and I have made it a lot more. There's a lot more in it. Yeah, I say. To start off with. This is signaling tape. Everybody carries signaling tape. Yeah, and to me personally, I didn't want to carry it. I guess because this is quite bulky. And it's in the way sometimes, and when you're washing, as you can see, it's hard to break off. And if you're fatigued because you're tired, you're hungry, that is just going to be hard work even more. So, what I've done, I've cut it down to 50 centimeter strips. Right, that's why 50 centimeters. To me, 50 centimeters is big enough. You're not going to put this wrap around a tree because if you wrap out, she's just not going to do that. You're going to wrap it around branches where you're going to see it, but it's just going to hang like that, and it's going to. Okay. Or if you see someone, if someone else can see it, you're not going to wrap it around a tree. So that's the reason why I've come to 50 centimeters. It's a round number. Yeah, and I do have quite a few, as you can see right there. And I'm still doing a few more of these. I wrap them around these paper bobbins because then when I need it, I can rip that off and just undo it. It is all done on by a bit of tape, but if you rip there and pull, it all comes out. So yeah, that's what that so far is the signaling tape. I keep my going back onto this now. This is my signaling kit here. This is where I keep it. This is where it's going to stay because it's important. Apart from my large signal panel. This is the one I made for my friend. She said it was too small. So she's asked me to do another one and I've said I'll do it on one and later on because this took over a day just to make. I'll show you quickly. This is a three foot by one and a half foot Three foot long by one and a half foot wide signal panel. As you can see, it is massive. It's bright, it's everything is, and I did make this myself. I did get the material, my friend got the material in. As I said, she wanted someone bigger, so I'll have to make her one bigger. I have put some grommets in each corner so I can hang it. So yeah, and um, so that's the signal panel. I do have two signal panels. I have one built into the rucksack as well as that one there. But going back into this pouch here is my signal pouch. What? I do have one of these UCO splash flash lights. It's a strobe run. It does SOS. I know there's silly little things on these. I don't keep the battery in it, so yeah. Here is some more signal tapes, already cut up, ready to go. There's quite a bit in there. And in the back of this one, I do keep a small Tinder pouch kit stuff. I am thinking about adding that inside, actually. I might actually do that now while I'm thinking about it, because there's a little sleeve in here where I can just add it in because I think it might be a little bit more safer in there. So there's the signaling tape. Yes, it's in another pouch because I don't want it to go everywhere. I do have a few of these and it is these chem, whatever you want to call it, survival thing or safety. Basically, you open it up and you spin it around, I guess. Yes, I know I could have bought normal glow sticks, but I was off with these, so I took it and that nicely because they nicely fit in this pouch. So, yeah, I do carry 
two of them in this bag pouch. There's the battery. Um, UCO splash flash. The last thing, I think it's the last thing. Yeah, last thing in this pouch. I can't wait. This. This is. And sorry, that's that's not UCO. That's UST. Sorry, my mistake. That's UST. This is UCO. It's a torch. I'm not. I am. I've got the um. Got something to stop this going on. As you can see. Nothing goes on, but in here it's a batch capsule, what I like. And, um, yeah, I do. Why do I carry matches in here? Because to me personally, I don't want to dig around my rucksack. I don't want to dig for something if I need it in a certain situation. That's the reason why I have these matches, as well as some tinder, in here, ready to go. So, yeah, I'm not really a big... I've spent a lot of money on this kit. I shouldn't have, but I have. I do have a signal mirror, but that's on my belt. You already know that, guys. Same as a whistle. I have that on my shoulder straps. So, yeah. But quickly, I'll show you this one quickly. I, I like this piece because it's smart to have. I do have another... <coughs> signal panel built in to my work truck so yeah this is a piece of kit i think personally some people forget about so yeah so i'm leaving it here guys thank you very much for watching if you like the video please put the please put the thumbs up and please share this with people who you think needs who needs to uh, people like to watch it and please subscribe if you haven't already and thank you very much for watching and we'll see you soon bye bye